My name is Niall Kennedy. I am doing my PhD in the physics department out in UCD. The focus of my research is in soft X-ray microscopy. So first, let's talk about X-rays. X-rays are a part of the electromagnetic spectrum between the ultraviolet and gamma ray regions. An X-ray image, say for a broken bone, uses hard X-rays due to the high density of bone and surrounding tissue. An X-ray image, such as the one of the hands shown here, is formed when X-rays pass through the tissue but are absorbed by the bone and the dense materials such as the ring on her finger. Soft X-rays are less energetic than their hard counterparts. Soft X-rays are usable on cells due to an area known as the water window. This is a special region of radiation where carbon, just like the bone before, absorbs soft X-rays, whereas the water, like the tissue, transmits soft X-rays. The process of soft X-ray microscopy starts with the formation of a plasma. My research will involve finding suitable targets that can be used to form these plasmas. To investigate this, I will be firing a high-powered laser at the target and observing the spectra it produces. The aim is to find a source that has a high brightness in the region known as the water window. Once I have the soft x-rays required, I can then use them for imaging. I should be doing this using a process known as contact microscopy. This is where the sample is directly in contact with the detector. The detector I plan to use is lithium fluoride. Lithium fluoride, when exposed to ionizing radiation, such as soft x-rays, produces color centers. And when these color centers are exposed to blue light, they fluoresce and produce red light. So when the sample is illuminated by soft x-rays, at the places where the soft x-rays transmit through the sample, color centers shall be produced. This is similar to how a normal x-ray works, where the x-rays penetrate through the tissue onto the detector. The aim of my research is to find suitable materials that produce strong soft x-ray emission, which can then be used in conjunction with lithium fluoride to produce images of high resolution. I'll be focusing on adapting or creating new methods to produce images of the best quality.